Okay, we're looking at Dan Sartain today. He's one of my favorite songwriters. He's done a bunch of albums. You need to check them all out. I'm going to show you three riffs from three songs from three of his albums. He's done loads of different stuff. He's done like a Ramon style punk album. He's done an electro album. He's done like cowboy stuff. He's even done a session at Sun Studios. So you can check all this stuff out at Bandcamp and buy it there. We've had the pleasure of playing with him a couple of times with my band X-Ray Cat Trio and hopefully we'll be able to play with him again in future when people can tour again. So Dan plays a lot with a band but he also performs solo so the songs are picked. You can hear him play with a full band. When Dan's playing solo he'll play the chords but also the lead lines and they can be quite simple but really catchy. first one we're going to look at is called Ruby Carol. It's from the Dan Sartain Lives album. I think on the record it's in B flat. There's also a really nice video of him playing it solo. I think he's playing it in B flat or B, but we'll stick to B flat for now. And here's that riff. There's the first line. We're in B flat minor, so he's playing this minor chord. And there's a number of different ways you can play that chord. You've got the bar chord, the full thing like this. You can kind of half play it with your thumb. You can just do the top part if you want. However you want to do it, but he's kind of playing the lead line and then the chord straight after. So that's cool in itself. Uh, the next part of that is going to go up. So it's playing those notes there. Before he goes to the next chord, which is going to be an F sharp. And that's a major. Then to the F. So all together you've got Okay, so that's Ruby Carroll. If you want to make that even easier to play, you can move it to the A minor, so you've got that open chord. So we're playing those same notes, but moving it down to the A and using the open strings where we can. And then we're going to go to the F and the E afterwards. <laughs> Next one we're going to look at is Flight of the Finch, and this one's off the album Join Dan Sartain. This one was recorded with a mariachi band, so it's got a bit of a mariachi feel to it.
It's another one that he's played solo, so he's played the chords and lead lines together. And this one's in G minor. <laughs> rhythm part is kind of just staying in G minor for most of it. So here's the lead part. So that's the lead line and he's just adding that to that minor G chord. That's it. And the verse part's got a nice chord progression. Starting off with the G minor. Then we go to a D7. Then to a C7. B flat. C7. D7. And G. So you've got. Okay, and then with the solo, it's all staying in that G minor. Slides up here. Tenth fret on the A string. kind of comes back up again this little run back up and then slides up to the tenth again oh yeah in the chorus we're going up to a C major back to the G minor adding in some slides down on the bottom string probably from the G up there cool that's Flight of the Finch the last one I'm going to show you is called Lonely Hearts it's off one of the earlier albums Dan Sartain versus the Serpientes I think it's pronounced the Serpents he's got a thing about snakes this guy <laughs> Yeah, this is probably the track that got me hooked on Dan's stuff. I just really like that guitar part and the vocals and the lyrics and it's kind of trashy sounding. So this is what this sounds like. So here we go. This one's in A minor. <laughs> It's all around that A minor chord. For the verses, he's just playing single chords. A minor. C 
and it's kind of like a B, but it's just taking that C shape and bringing it all back one fret. I think that's what it's doing, I don't know. That's what it sounds like to me. Back to the A minor, and then to a D, then to an E. All the cowboy chords. Sometimes he does a D minor in the second verse, I think. But just listen to it, see what you think. Then for the chorus, it's the same chords, just ragging it out a bit. pretty much that song, that's it. If you want, you can try and play the lead and the chords together a bit. That's Lonely Hearts, Dan Sartain. Yeah, okay, check out Dan Sartain, go on his band camp, buy his stuff. He's also a barber, you can get a haircut from him if you're in Birmingham, Alabama. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed that. If you want to see some more stuff like this, comment below. Check out the website if you want to buy some merch to support us. There's a shop there. And let me know what you want to see next. Cool, thanks for watching. See you later.